cabaret. What was I thinking? I could have been down here. I don't even know where you go in the thing. That's not what she said. But definitely an older part on this side. You can see that sign for the Virginian there. Actually, I'm gonna zoom up to that. That's just cool, old and nostalgic there. And, ha, uh, a nuke Starbucks. But bottle service at the Wild Old Adult Cabaret. Holy smokes! Seriously? This place is huge. That can't be, they got rooms too. You know, that could be, it's Reno. They could take you upstairs for the full service, I'm sure. I've gotta know more about this. I'm gonna look this place up. Because that's just interesting. That is a huge, huge thing. Room starting at 14 bucks. Holy smoke and balls of something. Find your favorite lap dancer. dancer. There she is. Get an extra 14 bucks. And you're in truly the best. Topless, topless girls. Interesting. Yeah, man. You're in it right from the front. I guess I'm wondering how classy a place like that could be. And also, it would be kind of interesting to come stay here just for the hell of it. Kind of get a review of it from the inside out. That's what she said. Popo! Well, I'm looking for 240 something. 628! I think that lady was full, but she sure was. She told me it was right down here. It ain't right down nowhere. There's a lot of here in between there and here, I think. But, may as well check it out. Maybe see something I hadn't seen before. We'll talk to you. Well, we were going to Shepler's up here and it just happened to be quite a bit of a walk. And not that I really cared. I don't mind the walk. I just wanted to get the car and check the town out in whole and drive around a bit. I hadn't, you just cover so much more ground and we've got two cars here in town. So it kind of is the perfect opportunity for that. Kind of a, a drive around. Best friends puppy store. Puppies for sale. The little mini beagle breeder. There's Breeder. She kind of goes everywhere. She's a Reno dog. Well, we'll yeah, see hello. You. The Jelly Donut Cooling Laundry. Don't matter when you turn the f camera on here, there's always going to be something ringing. I think that was an old Winchell's. Sure looks like it. I have Marshalls. Okay, we are looking for Shepplers. And I'm thinking that we are darn close. And on the left over here, where are the Marshalls? They've actually got a store here, whereas usually you get that big mail order place. And I'm gonna head over that way in a second. But there's just a little bit more town down here. I was thinking about looking at the Century Theater. Parkline Mall. Wow, they've torn it down. No joke, they tore the mall down. I knew there was something missing over on this side of town. I mean, it's been 15 years, but holy smokes. You know the malls are going out and all, but torn down? That's just, it's not amazing, I guess. Stuff changes, but. Range Rover, Land Rover, the Pepper Mill. This is a really big casino brand around. They have quite a few of them in Nevada, I believe. And wow, that's a nice looking place, for sure. I almost rented this one. 
but they weren't dog friendly. We need a dog friendly place on this trip. Just depends on the trip, but this time, the dog's alone. Love them old Vegas signs, especially at nighttime when they're all lit up. Awesome. European Fitness Center. Why would it be a European Fitness Center? I don't get that. European Fitness Center Garden Restaurant? Why is it a European one? You going to Steam Nude? It's the only difference I can think of in the different. You guys got the same equipment we got. Well, I'd rather be working out in Netherlands than here. Yeah, I can say that. Roscoe's Joint. All about cars. They got just cool old things down here that look... Oh, wow, look at that old building. Well, I'm going to turn it around now pretty quick. Just wanted to head down towards the Atlantis Casino here. The old bowling alley. Yeah, I'm turning around. We shall see ya. I'll clip some more in here later. Oh, beautiful Sierra Nevada mountains up there. I guess that's what it would be. You would think so. Well, maybe you wouldn't, but I would. I might do out the window here too. Pretty day. Pretty place. We'll see ya. The Atlantis. There's always, um, you know, vodka and just cheap vodka. And then there's just kind of dark marketing. And like, I kind of don't market this way usually. I may say things that are kind of off color. That's what she said and things, but skinny girl cocktails. Okay, if this don't create some lushes, I don't know what will. Skinny girl vodka, tangerine flavored, 30 proof, so it's kind of, kind of womanly. They got like a sangria too, pina colada, but it's just the marketing. A lady loves locale options. Skinny girl, drink like a lady. Come on. That is going to create some luscious, buddy. Okay, well, that's all I know. Ain't actually buying no liquor. I like looking at liquor prices. I will take your free drinks there in the casino any day of the week. But I do like checking out different things. Ah, lots of flavored vodkas out there nowadays. They've really came into that with the citron type thing. And I guess probably in drinking alcohol type things. Vodka is one of what would be my favorites, I guess. You know, nice, I like a good, I like the good blue label and the, where they got the blue and the green. They have to. Good scotch and good whiskey is hard to, the black label. The black label ain't all that. It really is not. I thought it would be, but it's not. Okay, well, that's that. Just some quick video of alcohol. We'll see ya. Well, cruising along Reno, Nevada, and I just had to get that. Not that. That just came up in front of the camera. That has a way of doing that to me. I'm walking by, all of a sudden a booty goes right in front of my camera. But that's your prices for gas here in Reno. Just kind of interesting little deal. And thought I'd drive through and I wouldn't want to give up an arm or a leg or anything and show you what we got here in Reno. And there it is again! It's rocking everywhere, that's for sure. So here we go, I was gonna go back up here. I was actually heading the other way, but there's two super cool little kind of bar pub type places, a Studio 16 hotel. Definitely a small hotel that closed up. Definitely something that'd be cool to buy. Yeah, baby, 450 a month for apartments. I don't know what this is. $13 off any large pizza? What the hell, how much do they cost to begin with? Crazy. So I'm gonna get up here and show you Archie's.
just a unique looking building. And make a guy want to go in there and eat. Look like it might have some good greasy, yucky food. Reno's best breakfast. Fresh squeezed orange juice. Giant hamburgers, huh? Looks like a cool place. But there's also some cool places down there in the middle of downtown. Talk about yucky, icky, greasy spoon. That's what they got. Another post office. There's the old school one downtown. And just some stuff out on the hills. This is the extreme. I'm not going to go for the east, north, and all that. I don't know which way it is. But there's the town up in the skyline there, you can see. And everything over here is the lifting deck. Stadium. I'm going to drive up over there. This is the college here in Reno. Whatever one it is. I'm not making it across that. I thought I was going to. I'm just not. A little bit of traffic. A little bit of traffic. It's really not worth driving in here to show this stadium either. But we're driving around. I wanted to see it. Free permit parking to the planet. The planetarium. The planetarium, yes sir. West Stadium Parking Complex. Bet you could get a super cool view from up on the top of that, huh? She's gonna have to really make that turn wide. <laughs> well, I seen in it. And it was definitely a big old stadium. I figured if I got in here, there we go, there's a way. I'm gonna walk up on it here. Why not? At least see the stadium just a little bit. We have to move this kind of problem. Yeah, I might be able to see a little bit of it at least. University of Nevada. There's our buses. Matthew, tall dude, one, two, three. There's a bus for you. I don't even know what kind they are. They look a little bit different than the kinds you see in Canada and over in Netherlands. Well, gotta show you the stadium. in there with the bleacher type seating that's all set up. No. You can barely kind of see down there. They got a track going around it. Definitely too enclosed to get to. What kind of car is that though? The police command post. It looks like they just set that there. And it's just been sitting there the whole time. Don't look like the command post is going nowhere, buddy. Well, I was hoping to get a real close up of it, but that's the best you're going to get on this review. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. I don't even know if you're watching anymore because it's just a random video. But really cool looking place. I'm heading this way. I'm gonna see if I can get up top and get a little more. That's what she said. I'm like, sure. Get on up there, girl. Man, they got it all blocked off with this here. They're pretty slick at that. I could jump right up on that building. That'd get you in trouble. Oh, cool, man. Well, I knew I'd get you a gooder. Gooder? That's not a word. A better 
picture than what I was at there. Too bad you can't get inside. Well, I guess you can. You buy a ticket. Look, they got a step right there for me to jump up on top. Ah, why do you want to get in trouble? I tell you. One, ownercarguy.com. Beaglespocket.com. And that is that. There's somebody down there. I better get back to my car before they tow it. Well, we'll see ya.